Now in this video tutorial, what I want to do is to take the post that I created. Remember I'm creating a post here. And uh, what I want to do is I want to make this post so it's going to show up on my web page or my website and have it located under a menu item called Home. So the first thing I want to do is I'm just going to go ahead and make sure that I've updated everything. And then I'm going to go ahead and just preview the changes. And when you see, what I want you to see right now is that I have an About Me, I have a listing, and I have video tutorials. But I don't have a Home button right here. And what I want to do is I want to have a Home here with the purpose that if I'm over here, some, for example, and I'm on uh, the page for video tutorial, I'll go back here for uh, on Home Staging, for example, what happens is is that I can actually go back over here and get a button that will take the user back to home. So that's what I'm trying to get accomplished here and also make that so that's the first page the users see. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back here to my dashboard and now that I have this posting that I've made I'm going to go down here to appearance and then I'm going to go to menus. And what I want to do is I want to make the menu the home button to come right up on the top so it's going to be to the left. So in other words you almost have to think of laying this thing out horizontally if you will. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and I'm going to go into categories. Now depending upon what you've been doing um, in my case because of the fact that I've been back and forth and testing different things. Under most use you'll see where I have these home buying tips here. And you're, if you're, if it's the first time you've done it, you may have to go over here and select view all because this may be the first time you've done this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect this uh, home buying tips here and I'm going to say add to menu. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go up here and you'll notice that I have located right here home buying tips. Now if I was to go ahead and uh, preview this on the menu and just say save this, what's going to happen is, and I visit the site, you're going to notice that the home buying tips are over here. So for example, if I click on About Me, there's About Me. If I want to go to Home Buying Tips, I click this button right here. So what I really want to do is I want to take this from here and I want to put it over here. And it's very simple to do. All I read, need to do is go back to Menus then I just need to take the home buying tips right here and just put it, drag it up and put it directly on top of About Me right here and then all I have to do is save the menu. Now if I go back in I just want to show you that this is what I've done so far. Okay so now I have my home buying tips and I have About Me and you know so if, for example if I go over to About Me and then I want to go back to home buying tips I do this. If I go over here and go to home staging and then I want to go back to home buying tips I click here but I don't want this to say home buying tips. What I want it to do is just say home you know so that that's the location or home location. So what I do is I go back up here go back again to menus and then right here underneath the menus the home buying tips I'm going to drop this little button down here and where it says navigation label I'm just going to go ahead and just delete that part and just leave the word home I could call it anything I'm just going to call it home go ahead and say save and now when I go back up here and visit the site you'll see that my it says home instead of home buying tips so again, this is a way that you can put a menu item on here. Uh, this is the page that typically will load whenever the user first goes to my site. Uh, this is something that, uh, again, that I want to look at as a news, if you will, article. As I add new postings to here, this item will continue to go down and the new ones will show up on top. That's by default. Of course, there's always many different ways that I can switch this around and change it. But at this point, what I want to do is what we've done here is to talk about, again, how we go in here. We uh, go to menus. Just remember that uh, we can make a menu item from either a page or a post. So what I did is I went down here and I selected the post. Remember to also make sure that you, if you don't see this here, click on view all. This will show you your categories. Remember you have to check here and tell it to add to the menu. 
then once you have it up on the menu, it'll always by default show down at the bottom. I have to drag it back up to where I want it. And then to change the name of the menu, I need to just go in here and give it a different, uh, what we call label. And then once I'm all done with it, I need to go ahead and save the menu. And then of course, go back up again, visit my site and test it and make sure everything works. So I'll go back and forth. I'll say I'm here on home staging, go to about me. And then if I want to go back to home, I can do that. So it allows the user to move around back and forth. So again, I think this is really important. Uh, postings are really critical. They're a way that you can get information up on your website uh, for people so that they always um, go to your website. A good thing to do is that once you do update your website is to send out an email to uh, all of your um, followers, uh, you know, on Twitter, people on Facebook, people on LinkedIn, uh, also your database. In other words, sending out an email link and saying, hi everybody, I just uh, updated my website uh, with so new information, for example, in this case, on some home buying tips. Put your link into your website there. It'll take you directly to this page, to your top page or your landing page, whatever you want to call it. And then the people can go ahead through and read the article. And uh, again, this is a very important tip to designing your uh, website.